It's been a long ride, buddies. The sun's set out right up there. In here, harsh winter is already done. But remember, rules of the thumb, weather change their moods. Before it sucks, I gotta find a family. I think I should go right up there. I see the flock of sheep out there. The family must be getting closer. Well, that's right. I found a family probably I stay overnight here wow the weather's getting cold man I'm I'm hanging out in the north of Mongolia. It's called Siling Province. It's a vast province. I just met the first family in this area. Afterwards, I'm the Honda. Oh, yeah. Ja Honda. That's it. That's it. That's pretty interesting. These guys offer me some very interesting dish. Have you ever had the uh, dumpling with ribs before? I bet you you never had that. This family gave me some hospitality. Appreciate. Let's check that out. What is that rib? Dumpling. Yeah. I'm lucky to have met this guy. He was studying as a chef in Yubi, is a big capital city in Mongolia. Let me tell you some cultural facts about Mongolian food. A few decades ago, Mongolia had no broad classification of foods. We'd got some reasons. First country is landlocked far from the seafood. The only food factory is their livestock breed, meat, fat, and dairy products. Yeah. Oh, yeah. And then extremely continental climate influenced use of vegetables and spices limited. <laughs> Summertime was only the chance to get wild berries, onions, and some edible plants. But we can cook many types of dishes by using only flour and meat. <laughs> These little kids hang around here because it's a um, half spring time. Baby kids are everywhere and they leave with the family. <laughs> Hello, 
تومسوی یه ضروریت هورگا کرده. Ахтергин давс цад. За тэнд орсон лоовн тумс манж маан одоо таны хоолны чи хачир болно. Махны маан хачир болно. Сайхан асах. За одоо ингээд хагас чансаа хавьраа тодорхой хэмжээгээр амтлахаа хийв. А тэрэнд маа сармис тэгэд ногоон сөнгө. Ногоон сөнгө Сангы сэрмсний аг маань та ингээд бахандаа шингэж игээ. За одоо яг үл гурл бэлэн мах бэлэн тийм ээ. Одоо гурл маань амарсан байгаа. Одоо гурлаа сайхан илтээд томор нь дийлэж байгаа. Надад тэр нь л амар хэд. Харин тик бол нөгөө хавьрагнууд янз бүрийн хэмжээт байгаа. Dumpling, you know, it's uh, familiar to billions. Almost every country has cooked their own dumplings. I think this must be real Mongolian version of dumpling with the rib. Tima? Yeah. <laughs> In Mongolia, we call that bolts. You see that ribs are so cool with the fat and also seasoned with some garlic and onions. Oh man, I can't wait to eat it. Yeah, that's Nick Boots. Nick Boots. So you should have heard the Boots to me and then it's there. Hoyer Boots. Mm-hmm. Yeah, Sturm Boots. I think I will try one pinch. So I'm going to try that. I'm going to try that. I'm going to try that. Oh, man. За би бас тахажууд нь давхар чимхэд юу вэ та хараа чимхэд шүү. You see this? That was pretty challenging. I'm really bad at pinching bolts. Look at that. What's it like? Like a dead rat. It's fine. I'll make it much better. Cool. You need to do it now. Compare and contrast the design, guys. That's chicken skin, and that's that. There's a steamer up there. Ooh, not just sahar, it's shot. Holding that sandwich, guess I can't touch it. But then, you're already not that controlled. Oh, damn. That would be really good combination. Baby sheep and kids are everywhere in here. I think it's good to you tend to be in it. So, what to go away to him by my house family received more than 100 baby sheep and goats so far. That's cool. Ну мини хийсэн бодс чи юм шиг тус гайгүй бас ч гэж байна. Я я стэц, э? That's awesome. That's that's really cool. Thank you so much. This is the dumpling with the ribs. It's much more clear now how it's made. So let's try. 
Wow, this is the uh, starter is a soup, man. Let's try soup. Mmm. The soup is so good. That's a good thing. That's a good thing. That's a Holy shit! Mm. Be careful, don't bite the bone. Mm. Mm. Oh man, that's <laughs> great. I need some mm. carrot. Oh man, this is the best version of the Mongol boat. Mm. Take the bones. <laughs> One more, please. One more, Nargi. So good. By the time the one here is done, the dish will. One here is done. The chicken steaks and the tower of the huelta. Mongolian food culture that I learned in depth is getting much cooler. Weather is getting nice and warm as well. We have already hit how Mongolian summer dishes are so healthy and jaw dropping. Let's keep up the journey together. That's my order. On the next episode. <laughs>